I'm just going to talk about lip sync for a second. So, um, yeah, so we all do like lip sync with like the basic jaw action, like, you know, let me tell you something. So that, that line, let me tell you something, feels to me like there's a big accent on the te of tell you. Uh, but there's a little sort of thing on let me, but I don't think it's particularly big. It's, if I do it, it's like, let me, it's, it's tiny. So he kind of goes halfway down with his jaw, so let, and there has to be a little bit of a backup for the, for the closed mouth, and then big for the tell, and then tell you, su uh, tell you, is all one closing action. So, and there's only one more, so it's something. And I think I would just do something, and I might do an elongated, slightly elongated closed mouth, so it's still a bit stretchy. But uh, it's either that or go something and a tiny little dip on thing, but it could just be something. Tony Fuchili would go something and it wouldn't ever stop on the way up. And Milt would probably do it too. Uh, where you would go, saw, you know, n if you were doing like a nose <laughs> sort of thing and, and you would do like a kind of a str slightly stretched M, you know, sort of as the jaw is on the way up and then it would kind of pause. It would still be going up, but it would slow down a bit as the lips parted and you would see the teeth, you know, get the tongue in there, and then it would sort of continue on its slow thing as you got a bigger mouth for the thing, and then it would do its final close into the ing of, of thing, right? So it would kind of go, punch open, slow down in the middle, and then close. It would be like, something, you know, just to have a little slow down in the middle. But it stops it from being, um, let me tell you something, you know, which everybody knows we don't want to do.